What's up guys, Daniel here. I got a super simple song for you today. It's called A Bar Song by Shibuzi. It's in standard tuning with capo on the second fret and it only uses four chords. You've probably already seen a bunch of tutorials out there for it, but stick around, you might learn something different with mine. Or you might not. Let's find out. So the four chords we're gonna use are gonna be E minor. That's just second fret A and D, the rest are open. We've got a G chord, third fret low E, second fret A, third fret B and high E. We've got a C chord. 3rd fret A, 2nd fret D, open G, 1st fret B, and then we have a D over F sharp. That's going to be 2nd fret low E, 2nd fret G, 3rd fret B, and high E. The basic strumming pattern for the song is going to be down, down, up, down, up, and then switch to the next chord. There's one exception at the end of the progression. I'll show you that in a second. So starting with that E minor, we're going to go down, down, up, down, up. Now we're going to switch to G and do the same thing. Now we're going to go to C, and what I want you to do with C is leave the D string open, and when we do that first down strum, I want you to hammer onto the second fret. And it'll go down, down, up, down. So just add that little hammer on there. And then now we're going to go back to G, and this is where it switches a little bit. We're going back to the G, and it's going to be down, down, up, and then switch to the D over F sharp. Down, down, up. So to go. And then you're just going to repeat that entire progression for the whole song. So I'll play it a couple times a little bit slower and then I'll play it regular speed and then I want to show you one other thing before I end the lesson. One more thing I want to show you that he does a couple times throughout the song and it's just the ending of that progression before he gets into the chorus. For example, just before he gets into the first chorus he plays this line. Two stepping on the table, she don't need a dance floor. Oh my good lord. And he gets right back into the progression for the chorus. So the only thing he changes there is when he gets back to that G chord. So we still have E minor, down, down, up, down, up, G with the hammer on. When he gets back to that G, he's just going to do two down strums and then mute the strings. So to mute the strings, all you have to do is rest your palm back on top of the strings after you do that second strum. So it'll go and then just put your palm back on top of the strings. You can release the pressure on your fretting hand. That'll also help mute it. So, so he says, oh my good lord. And then he gets right back into the progression. Pour me up a tub of shot of whiskey Maybe me and Jack Daniels got a history And you just keep going And that's all you need to know to play this song Like I said, super easy, great for beginners If you guys want to check out the tabs with the lyrics They're going to be on my website, link is in the description If you'd like to leave a request of your own Go ahead and do so in the comments below Please put hashtag request somewhere in there So I can find it easier later on when I'm checking my comments That's all for now Appreciate you guys watching Like and subscribe if you feel like it And I'll see you in the next video